The World Health Organization confirmed the first ever outbreak of Marburg disease in Equatorial Guinea, saying that the Ebola-related virus is responsible for at least nine deaths in the country. The health agency confirmed the epidemic after samples from Equatorial Guinea were sent to a lab in Senegal last week. The government had announced last week that it was investigating the cause of suspected case of hemorrhagic fever in a densely forested eastern region near the borders of Gabon and Cameroon on Africa's central western coast, but said only three people had shown light symptoms. The province has now been placed in quarantine. While addressing a press conference on the same health minister, Metoha Ondo Aikab said that a health alert had been declared in Kirnitem province and the neighbouring district of Mongomo, with a lockdown plan implemented after consulting with the World Health Organization and the United Nations. The WHO also added there were currently 9 deaths and 16 suspected cases with symptoms including fever, fatigue, diarrhea and vomiting. Marburg is highly infectious thanks to the rapid and decisive action by the Equatorial Guinea authorities in confirming the disease. Emergency response can get to full steam quickly so that we save lives and halt the virus as soon as possible. Dr. Mat Shidiso Moiti, WHO Regional Director for Africa mentioned. Marburg virus disease is a highly virulent disease that causes hemorrhagic fever with a fatality ratio of up to 88%. It is in the same family as the virus that causes Ebola virus disease, which has wreaked havoc in several previous outbreaks in Africa. The rare virus was first identified in 1967. The natural host of the Marburg virus is the African fruit bat, which carries the virus but does not fall sick from it. Illness caused by Marburg virus begins abruptly with high fever, severe headache and severe malaise. Many patients develop severe hemorrhagic symptoms within seven days, but the animals can pass the virus to primates in close proximity, including humans and human-to-human -human transmission, then occurs through contact with blood or other bodily fluids. Fatality rates in confirmed cases have ranged from 24% to 88% in previous outbreaks, depending on the virus strain and case management, according to WHO. The outbreak in Equatorial Guinea marks the first Marburg outbreak in the Central African country, though it noted previous outbreaks in sporadic cases in other parts of Africa, including in Angola, DR Congo, Guinea, Kenya, South Africa and Uganda. Last July, Ghana had reported two Marburg deaths for the first time in what were also the first cases in West Africa. Authorities declared an end to the outbreak in September. There have been previous outbreaks in sporadic cases in other parts of Africa, in Angola, DR Congo, Guinea, Kenya, South Africa and Uganda. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.